Hey, how's it going? In the other room, I have uh, a video processing. It's going to take a couple hours for it to process in there. And so uh, I have a big fan blowing into the side of it uh, so it doesn't potentially overheat while it's doing that. And so I'm making this video here. And uh, I imagine there's some people who would look at the you know, look at me putting that big fan there and they'd say, well, you know, you're supposed to use the case in the way it was designed and have the side on and put a, uh, you know, have the fans going, well, the main focus is to not have all the heat, you know, being kind of stuck in one area. So the heat sink has a chance to, to function uh, as it should. And so, you know, putting a huge fan next to it that's really a powerful fan, I don't think is going to uh, be a problem. I think that's going to be a lot better than the way that the, the regular case is. But there are some people who, who will obsess about uh, even uh, uh, cable management. Uh, and it's just like, that shit doesn't make any difference. It doesn't make any difference. I'll leave a link to a video that, that proves that it doesn't make any fucking difference. You'd have to stuff the computer with stuffed animals and foam and all this stuff. Just have it completely clogged with stuff in order for that to make a difference. So, um, having said that, you know, there's, there's people that they look, if, if they're like, well, it looks ugly if I don't do cable management. So do you want to be the one to spend a half hour just to access something? And then another 20 minutes or so to put it back the way that, it, that you know, that they have the, uh, the case designed. <laughs> uh, oops, one of your cables went out. Well, okay, that'll be two hours, three hours. Great. <laughs> you know, people are so concerned with the way that it looks when they open the side. I'm like, well, then don't open the side. Of course, some of them have these ones where you can see through everything. Oh, look, I want to see the boards. Okay, well, <laughs> have someone else work on that, you know. Um, you spend most of your time working with that, that, the crappy things you have to go through on a case that's using cable management. So, I was thinking about cars, and you open up the hood, and newer vehicles, they... Uh, Oh wow, it looks so nice. Yeah, but they're try working on one. Yeah, I'd prefer to have everything really accessible. The older cars, the older engines, things were a lot more accessible. Um, older cars are much easier to work on. And it's just, I think the way that they do things is to try to create more jobs. And in turn, they'll make more money out of that too. Um, with the way that they, they set up engines. I mean, to me, they could have something that's like a plug-and-play engine. Oh, your alternator went out? Oh, well, hit this, hit this button or flip this switch, pull, pull this part out, put the new one in, hit the button, and it's ready. You know, being able to just change things out like that. And even do things like that with the with other parts of the car, you know, things that have to do with the suspension and 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 uh, just just about everything in the car have have it be easy to change out, be easy to just I mean really easy. Now with things like that, those those elements of the car, they'd probably want it to be so it senses uh, you know there's there's computers in the car uh, that will tell other parts hey do this or don't do this. And so it's the parts of the car are locked unless you have that thing that, that the, the newer types of keys that, that you know, it, 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 can sen it can sense a signal. Is it Bluetooth? I don't, I don't know how it's exactly set up in that regard, but, you know, you get near the car with, with your keys and you can do these things now. Otherwise, you can't, and that way there's not going to be this problem with, Oh, a thief goes, oh, look, I, oh, look, this car, it's a new one. Oh, I need that part. And they just kind of walk up to it and, and change it, you know, uh, remove it. Yeah, let's, let's avoid that. But, you know, imagine if car companies were to do something like that. If they were to really make, some car company made a vehicle that's fully, easily serviceable like that. You know, that'd be fucking cool. 
uh, something where, you know, if you wanted to upgrade the size of the engine. And my camera is overheating. <laughs>